Okay, today we're going to make salmon patties. And I've got this small little can of salmon. And I get this at Sam's. And it's really, really good. Um, this will make two nice sized patties. If you want more, double the recipe or use that larger can of salmon. And uh, what I do is I will add the salmon. I add some oats to... Uh, you know, hold it together, and uh, I use the egg beaters. Um, if you don't use that, then just use an egg. So um, then I'm going to add some lemon pepper and some onion and some parsley and stir it up, and then I will take and make the little patties and uh, roll them in this uh, panko breadcrumbs. So let's get started. Okay, I wanted you to see the salmon. Um, it is just really pretty salmon. Um, the, it, I got it out of the can and just kind of broke it up with a fork. But, um, the nice thing to me is it doesn't have all those bones in it. So, uh, it's a nice, good salmon to start with. All right. Now, what I've done now is I've taken the, uh, salmon. I've added a fourth of a cup of the oats and a fourth a cup of the egg beaters. Uh, just add one egg if um, you're not using the egg beaters. And then I added parsley, lemon pepper, and minced onion. Now you add as much of that as you want. We kind of like a good bit, so I kind of sprinkled in. And Then what you do is you stir it up, and uh, as you can see, it's still moist. So I'm going to put this in the refrigerator and let it... Uh, you know, set up good because what this will ha what will happen is the oats will kind of, you know, soak up and um, also it plumps up the onions. So um, this is why I kind of like to uh, let it sit in the refrigerator a while because if you just do it and cook it immediately, those onions haven't, you know, really plumped up and and they're still kind of crunchy. So. Um, that's what I suggest, but you do as you please. So after after it's sat in the refrigerator a while, then I'm going to take and make the uh, patties, and I will be rolling it in the panko breadcrumbs, and I'll show you that shortly. Okay, I've let the um, salmon mixture sit in the refrigerator a while, so now it's ready to make the patties. So I've got it all stirred up. See, this looks really good. It's not it's moist, but it's not all runny. Okay, so I've got my little panko breadcrumbs here, and I'll be making my two patties and then rolling it in the breadcrumbs. Now I've got this, um, mine happens to be Phillips, but, um, you know, one of those George Foreman grills. Um, these things are great. Um, you can cook yours in a skillet if you want, but this just makes it really easy because it'll get crispy on both sides and um, it's just easy. So anyway, we'll continue on with that momentarily, but right now I'm going to make the patties. Alrighty, here's my two little patties. They're all covered with the panko breadcrumbs and I'm going to cover it with some saran wrap and let them sit in the refrigerator for a little bit before I, I uh, cook them. So check back soon. Okie dokie. Time to cook them. Here's my two little patties. And here's my... I've got it plugged in and heating up. And I've sprayed it with some Pam. So we'll go ahead and put these on there. One. And two. All right, now, I'm going to close this down, and we'll cook away. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to just check back, and uh, whenever the outside gets crusty, it's time to eat. Okay, let's check it out. Ooh, don't they look good? I think they're ready to come up. Whoops. Don't these look good? Perfect. 
crusty and yum 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 okay